Hi everyone, welcome to CAD 101 Care Tips. My name is Lisa and I'm a CAD lover just like you guys. In this season, we will be covering 16 interesting topics on how to take care of your cat. have in the premise? The answer is most likely as many as they want, as long as they do not jeopardize themselves or other pets. For an example, you can have a bird and a cat at the same time, but will this traumatize you like what you have watched in the Looney Tunes between Sylvester the cat and Tweety Bird? Well, it does not have to be that way if you can follow some tips that I'm about to share with you. Placing the cage at a high and safe place making it barely possible to the reach of your cats will be the best solution. Definitely not nearing the cage to any countertops, as cats are natural climbers and countertop or pedestals, even shelf, can be easily breached onto reaching your bird's cage. So that's why suspending the cage is the best to encounter this issue. If at all you notice, your cat eyeing on your birds or pawing on the catch, use the water spraying technique or you may also try by using a roll newspaper by hitting it hard on the floor. This will make them slightly scared and irritated and somehow send them a signal that it's not a thing to mess with. Having one in your premises is a fun scenario. However, you do not want either of them intimidating or angering each other. Prevention is always better than cure. So looking at these precautions for the bird seems more vital and easier to be managed compared to your cat, as birds are more likely to feel more contented. I hope this tip will be useful to you. Till we meet again in our next episode, remember, having a happy cat makes a happier you.